Welcome. 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 Love day three. Some of my bid, man. What the fuck is this shit, man? I don't know what the fuck this shit is. Love day three. Love day three continues. Ignis section. Ignis section. Ignis section predictions. Trying to get my bro on here. Hold on. Try to see if I find a card and shit. Good, 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 good. Yo, I wrote it down, bro. Ah, you clutch, bro. I'm about to go and look for that shit. I'm like, ah, man, I don't want to, you know bro. what I mean? Act on the shit, you feel me? Every time I go live, I always do this shit where I be like, yo, why the fuck I ain't write down the battle? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I wrote some shit down. I wrote, I wrote both days down and shit. So we good to go. All right, so you want to do both days? Uh yeah, we could run through both days. All right, so um, let's do day one, All which right. is love day. Let's, let's give them a little, a little bit. So let's see, see, get some people on here real quick. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, of course, man. You know let me, what I mean? Let me add a couple people and shit. Let me do the same. Let me do the same. I I had everybody I needed to to do, but like. So I hate fucking Android, kid. This shit is... Now you got... <laughs> you feel me? Like, I invited... Yeah. Every... Here we go. Here we go. Now I get to invite other people. All right. And all, and all these ugly niggas in here. Pause. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, because we need to, we need to talk. And I'm going to be completely honest, yo. <sighs> Oh, I'm gonna be honest. You know I am, dog. Yeah, like I keep I keep it a buck sometimes, and I usually don't give the whole. I give like fifty five percent of the truth. Yeah, but today we're going to give all. We're gonna, I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell the whole truth. You know what I mean? So yeah. we're gonna, definitely gonna be that's, talking. That's how we gotta do. Yeah, man. All right, Fuck. man. Motherfuckers probably all watching the game, so we just going we gonna to jump into this shit, man. All right, let's go. Let's go. All right, uh, day one, you want to start from the bottom of the car going to the main event or main event down? Uh, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Bottom of the car to the main event. All right, day one, Bubba versus Henny number three, man. Is that is that three rounds or one? You know if it's it's three or one? I don't even know, bro. I don't, I think it's three. I think it's I three think rounds. It's yeah. Um let's let's all right, Ignis section. I'm gonna be honest, yo. I don't see any number three winning this bad. Oh, it's three rounds? Oh. Talk uh talk confirmed it. Three rounds. Three um rounds. I don't see any number three winning this battle. I agree. I don't see him winning this battle. Like, I'll be honest with you. He hasn't shown me nothing to this point that will make me pick him versus Bubba Ford. No shade to Penny 3. He's a good prospect. But Bubba Ford is – let's be let's keep it a buck. Last year, 2017, we were all talking about Bubba Ford – like he was, he was pretty much one of the dudes that was projected to get a look. He had a slip right. up, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. But I think 2018, he's back with that raw battle. It's one instance, but I'm looking for more consistency after that. And I think he's gonna make an example out of Henny number three. Yeah, I honestly think um, Henny is good. Like you said, a good prospect. Y'all kind of threw him, y'all threw him to the fucking wolves with this battle, in my opinion. Because <laughs> honestly, he hasn't captured anything else other than punching. He doesn't talk about his opponent. He doesn't say anything directly to his opponent. He lacks that a lot, a lot, a lot. And I'm going to mm -hmm. be honest, like, we watch a lot of battles. For me, 
that random puncher don't last long. And and it's a three round battle. I can't hear three rounds of filler bars about that could go for any random person. And I feel like Bubba's gonna be so direct, son. Like, I think it's gonna be bad for Henny number three. I'm not gonna lie, man. I think it might be bad for Henny number three. This could be a great learning curve for him, though. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if he at least get round, but I honestly I got Bubba 3 0. Yeah, possibly. Yeah, I got three o. I got three o. Bubba. I got three o. Bubba clear. I mean, you know what? Kenny might steal around. He might. He might steal around. I think he, he got a chance to to steal around. We never know what he, what his prep was for this one, but I feel like Bubba is gonna out. You know, he he Bubba just got too much experience on him at this point. He knows what to do to win a three-round three, three round battle, you feel me? Like, instead of just consistently doing nonstop punches, that could be for any opponent. So, we'll, yeah. we'll see. And, uh, and my one, thing is that if you're going to be a puncher like that, you feel me? If you're going to be a – here's my thing about punching, and you guys got to understand this. If you're going to be a random punching nigga, you got to be fire in order to beat your opponent. You feel me? That's like, very creative. Very creative and very fire. If you just mediocre, my nigga, you're gonna put me to sleep. You're gonna put the audience to sleep. You're gonna when niggas show niggas show you not you, but if niggas show niggas battles and shit like that, niggas gonna be like, yeah, yeah. I, right. I, I lose right. credibility if I show you if I show niggas your battle. I don't want that. You know what I'm saying? And I don't want that. So yeah, I'm looking at Henny. I'm looking for Henny to step his shit up for this one. If not, he gonna get toasted. Yes, sir. Up. Uh, next next one. up. Next up is Stax versus Tania. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I actually like this battle a lot. Ah, uh, I like this battle too. Um, I'm gonna edge it. <laughs> To stacks, to one debatable, to one debatable. I can, I can see that for sure. I honestly think I got. I might have Tanium in this one. I, mm. I might have Tanium edging. I feel like because Tanium is not new like that. You know what I'm saying? He took a break and came back. You know what I'm saying? I think he 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 gets it. Definitely after you battle a nigga like Rubando. Yeah. He had to deal with a lot with that, son. That was that was a rough three rounds to go through. And, you know, he still got people that was feeling his material that told him, you know, they don't feel like he died and shit. I, I feel like he got his ass kicked, but I feel like he was still he was still good. Stax is not as as punch heavy as like Rue Bando, you feel me? There's there's a chance for him to, to out punch Stax, which would win him around or two, depending on what Stax angles may be, you know, because Stax executes at certain angles sometimes that lands for him better. Because he's not he's not a nonstop puncher either. So I don't know. I think I think um, Tanium going to edge that. I think Tanium can edge that two one. Um, there's so many variables in this battle. I like Tanium, but I feel in this battle Stax wants it more. Um, for the simple fact that I think he has the real big chip on his shoulder, and I feel that he don't get the credit he deserves, especially even to this day, people still comparing him to Chess. You feel me? It's stupid. I don't see it. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I think Stax is gonna do more. To, to to win this battle in Tanium. Tanium, I like Tanium. He can punch, but Stax knows how to battle now. I think he found his groove. Pause. And he Virtually. is going to he's going to land some shit on Tanium. You know what I'm saying? It's not gonna be an easy battle. It's gonna be a dog fight. But I got I got I got uh Stax Looking away to win and pick, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. stats still one debatable. 
Yeah, I can't blame you for that. I definitely think it's going to be debatable. It's going to it's gonna go back and forth. A lot of people, on, you know what I'm saying, it's going to be a lot of that arguing for this battle for sure. Um, I, The next one, I like this one a lot, B-Trails versus Stumbles. This is different. I still got B-Trails, though, winning this clear. <laughs> like, Me too. Stumbles is very uncanny, man. He's very uncanny, very different, and his style is different, but it don't always resonate for me. It doesn't always do anything for me. Sometimes I don't like it. You know what I'm saying? Like, and if this is a three round battle again, it's a three round battle. I can't see Stumbles keeping up with B Trails for three rounds, son. I just can't see it. I'm sorry. I, I don't see it, man. I I see this. I see this like this, right? I see. I see um B Trills taking the first. I think the I think the second might be debatable. And then the third the third is not gonna be close. You feel me? I feel I feel I think um, will give us one amazing round and then the other two is gonna be I right. I've never for, for, for at, I really haven't seen nobody beat B Trills in the first like that. Like B Trills be having some amazing first rounds, amazing first rounds, yo. You feel That's me? That's why I feel like Stumbles ain't gonna win this. Nah. Uh, After that first, be... I don't see him continuing. Like I think Stumbles first is gonna be like really strong. And then it's going to start to dwindle down. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. That's just me, though. Because, like I said, like, Stumble's style is very uncanny. And it don't always uh, it don't always do anything for me. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know. He's going to have to prove me wrong on that one for three rounds. But I got B-Trails with 2-1. Two 2-1 on, two on B-Trails. Yeah, I got 2-1. Let me say something right now. Um, For Stumble's, though, like, I, I completely agree with you. But... If Stumbles gets in his bag and raps that painful, you know that painful shit that he has. Like you, like you just make yeah. up your face. Nobody just is one. Let me let me let me say something. It's one thing that uh, say something in a battle. And you like, ooh, or, or, or chair, whatever. But then there's another type of reaction where you like, oh, nigga, why you say that? That the type of reaction that Stumble gets. And if you could get that for like. Three rounds, it's going to be a tough battle for Trills, but I got Trills taking that 2-1 clear. Yeah, I got him clearly winning this 2-1 for sure. Um, Next up, yo, this is this is really fire, and I don't know how this didn't happen yet, but your boy Clip versus Ox. That's like, I like that for We Go Hard, man. That's definitely a, that's a possible We Go Hard classic right here, man. For you guys, possible, you know? possible, like possible. If we get <laughs> if we get the ox with the energy from that Ortega battle, I I think it could be a classic. If we get the ox that that battled KO, then it's gonna be a classic. But here's the thing with ox: ox is too inconsistent. You Very. know, you know he's too inconsistent. And nah, I didn't see the. I, oh shit, I didn't see. Ox I did, up. I did. And, yo, I ain't go front. That shit had me fucking crying. <laughs> oh man, I gotta watch that after this. <laughs> He's doing the push-ups. <laughs> Pull-ups with no hands. That shit had me dying. But um, nah, I think this is three rounds. I think this is three rounds. It gotta be three rounds. It gotta be three. I ain't going to front, though, man. If Clip start ODing with the fucking, any of that, we trying to find with a flow leak, any of those type of shits, if he has one of those around, it could be really ugly. So I ain't going to lie to you, son. That, that shit be ridiculous, my nigga. Like, that he really knows how to draw in the crowd to make a really strong moment, son. And if he just does that, 
if he does that for every round, and I, which I feel like he's going to make sure there's a moment every round because, you know, it's Ox. You know what I'm saying? He not, he not battling just a random, you know, a random nobody or, or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Ox is a respected name in Legal Hard, and so is your boy Clip. And this kind of is a, yeah, let me get a, in my opinion, it's like a notch on the belt type shit, yeah. Got one of the vests out of the way, one of my peers type shit out the way real quick. So I don't know. I think I your boy Clip gonna get it though. I got Clip clear. I got Clip clear. I never seen nobody as of right now. I never seen nobody really beat Clip, like decisively beat Clip. Clip walks away with at least one or two moments every battle, bro. Like it's one round. What the blood? Oh right, no! Wow. Uh, Clip, Clip is gonna win. Clip, hey yo, Clip, Clip got yo, Clip got. There's no debatable. Body. There's no classic. Ox, you my nigga, son. I swear, Ox, you my nigga, bro. But I ain't gonna front. It might get ugly for you in there. It might get ugly. Holy it's shit! Gonna it's gonna be nasty. It's gonna be nasty for Ox. Oh man, yo, <laughs> yo. You know what? I think the best we could hope for is Ox actually just trying to make it close or somewhat debatable. But yeah. Clip is going to violate Ox. Right. You know what I'm saying? Violate. <laughs> and salute to Clip. I think this is his last battle. You know, it's his farewell battle. You know, so I think it is. I don't oh, know. Shit. If yeah. Damn. I to keep sounding worse and worse for you, my nigga. I ain't gonna hold you, son. His last battle? It's gonna be right. ugly. It's gonna be ugly. All right. Next one. Sheesh. Yeah. Next battle. Um <laughs> Farah versus Mo Mula. Very uncanny. <laughs> Yo, That's and the word, it, y'all. I'm using that word a lot. That shit. Very <laughs> uncanny. <laughs> They've been talking shit back and forth. Um, I don't know if y'all seen it on uh, Farrah Funeral's IG, but she posted the pic. I mean, not the pic, but the the, the clip of um Mo Mula battling Dot. I think in the second round, and she was like, "Oh, this is who I'm battling." And I'm like, "Yo, you probably didn't see the um the the Benji Lolo battle, cause <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm still alive." <laughs> um, no Kali bias, none of that. You know, well, she ain't we go hard enough, so it's no reason to be biased. But I'm just saying, no bias for for Momula. But I really think he gonna beat the shit out of Farrah bad. And it's funny because Farrah, one of my favorite female battlers from in the past, not recent work, but you know what I'm saying. Like the mu- the new Mula that started this year from the Benji battle. She about to see a whole different like moolah. Like it's, I don't know. It might be. It might get ugly for her son in that ring. I don't know. And Mo Mula is a is the is the perfect opponent. You know oh. what I'm saying? Because Farah is gonna try to make Mo Mula uncomfortable in the ring during her rounds and shit like that. And if you don't know Mo Mula, Mo Mula is confident and petty. So there's really nothing you can do in terms of defense. To try to catch him off guard. You <coughs> feel me? Not to mention the past two battles this year that I've seen from Mo Mula, Mupak. Whole different. It's gonna be on, filthy man. for it's gonna be filthy for Farah. It's gonna be filthy for Farah. And I will say this though, I give Farah a a, a a a puncher's chance, given the fact that she changed her style a little bit yeah. throughout the years. You feel me? She's not all disrespect. Now she's rapping. She adjusted to the time. She punches a little bit too. You feel me? But nah, nah. Mo Mo are gonna violate her the worst way. The worst way. So yeah, I got Mo. I got, I got yeah. whether it's a one round, it's one zero. If it's a three round, two on possible three zero. Yeah, too much. And given the fact that a lot of a lot of stuff that's been out there, and Mo Mula are gonna talk about it. Ooh, it's gonna get ugly. It's gonna get ugly, and he's petty. 
Why Petty? Nah. Nah. <laughs> Next joint, man. The two verse, first two verse two. New Jersey Twerk and Lou Castro versus Hayes the Gift and Chase Banks. I'm going to let you start with this one. I, I'm going to let you start with that one. All right, I'm going to start while you think about this. <laughs> I'm going to tell you what I think. Honestly, on paper, when I look at this, I have Hayes and Chase winning. It's pretty clear, to be honest. I'm going to tell you why. Only thing people really banking off of New Jersey's Kirk and Lou Castro is that they sound alike and that they're going to have chemistry because they both very energetic and do that style shit. We're going to sit here and act like Hayes and Chase didn't battle Prezi and and stacks and do great. They, you know, the shit with money and what you call it was really good. New Jersey Twerk and Luke Castro hasn't did a battle together. I don't know what they going, what's going to happen with that. It could be a failed experiment. It looks great on paper. I'm not going to lie. It looks really great on paper. But if I have to choose who I think is going to win, who I know is going to be a well-rounded team, I got to choose Hayes and Chase. Like, I already know what to expect. I know they're not going to... They're not going to be off. They're going to be on point. They're going to be on key with each other. You know what I'm saying? To me, Lou and New Jersey twerk is an experiment that might be fire. I don't know. I don't want to bank on that. So I'm going to go with Chase and Hayes. Man, but if New Jersey twerk and Lou Castro fucking, if that shit you know, click, man, God damn. It's, damn. it's, it's all, somebody on this, That's somebody it. commented and they kind of spoke on what I was thinking. Like, you gotta understand, like, Luke, I mean, yeah, like, um, New Jersey Twerk has been on a tour. You feel me? And he's been taking bad on left and right. That's a, that's a, that's a negative. In addition to that, in addition to that, um, on Hayes, Hayes, Hayes and, um, Chase's, uh, yeah, actually, that works. Hayes and Chase's side, right? Yeah. Last year, Hayes was up here. Now he lives in North Carolina. So that dynamic is going to be very tough to, to get your shit straight. That Luke, That's true. Luke Castro and Twerk can drive to each other's houses and practice like nothing. You know I me? Mean? To counter what you just said, though, Hayes and Chase – they're not a performance tag team, though. They're a pin tag team. They don't do performance shit, really, besides the back-to-back -back shit, which is something that they can easily practice real quick over the phone. So, like, I know New Jersey Twerk and Lou Castro is going to be, they need that performance edge because that's both of their style, and that's what we're expecting. We're expecting them to be live, very loud, and, you know what I'm saying, haymakers everywhere and some creative shit. With both of them as a as a tag team, but I'm just saying like Hayes and and um what you call they a pen though they they focus a lot on what they write in, you know what I'm saying? They fight they focus a lot on what they write in. So I don't know I I don't think that's gonna put too much of a too much of a hurt on their style as a tag team. Yeah, but at the same time, team footage. Can be dope in a one rounder if it's one round, but judging off of the last last time I saw them versus home team Dougie and Money, they weren't that effective live and on camera. You feel me? Yeah. And you're going against a duo that is more dynamic than that. I don't know. You feel me? They're gonna have to be. They didn't wow me in that battle versus Dougie and Money, to be honest. They didn't wow me, but I could still see that they, the the chemistry. You feel me? Like the chemistry was still there. I was so I wasn't saying like as of the what they did in the battle as like a, to the opponent. Like I'm saying like the chemistry, like chemistry wise. I see they already had that click. You know what I'm saying? Like like they when they write, I could tell it's already going to be on some like yeah. Yeah. Oh, you said that. I next like they gonna be on it. So you feel me? Like I could tell they have that energy already together. I don't know if Luke Castro and New Jersey twerk 
it's going to be as effective that way for, for them. So I, that's why I have to pick Hayes and Chase, man. I was saying, yeah, yo, you know what? Fuck it, tell you right, dog. They might just die. I ain't gonna hold you. Yo, team footage might just die. I'm not gonna lie. Like, because they got I mean, some the possibility. There is a, a strong possibility. A strong. We talking about twerk and Lou. If Lou Castro, first of all, Lou Castro might be doing most of the heavy lifting pause. You feel me? Because of the simple fact that he hasn't battled in a while. Twerk can can fight <coughs> last minute like nothing. You feel what I'm saying? The shit that he came up with at um at the uh, at, at the gay league, and nigga did that shit the day before like nothing. That, that shit is it is very it's it's scary, scary, bro. What could possibly happen from it? But I also seen New Jersey twerk choke and stumble through mad performances by herself. So I wouldn't be surprised if he fucked this nigga Lou Castro up with the in the two on two. You feel me? Like choking That's some the shit. Only thing I'm scared shit. of is prep. You feel me? If and they could fuck up. They could fuck up. And that could <laughs> fuck up the battle. And they could lose that way. I know Chase and Hayes is gonna be fluent all three rounds. Or one round, whichever, whatever. If it's one round, they more in trouble than if it's three rounds. I, I thought, I don't know if it's three rounds or not. I'm a guess it's one. If it's one and they, and Luke Castro and Twerk click, it could get ugly, but I'm still going with Chase and Hayes because I know what I'm getting. But I'm very intrigued with that team, like that matchup. That matchup got me hype. That's a fire matchup. Uh, New Jersey Twerk and Luke Castro to match them up as a team. Just to clear it up, that was the day that Clip battled Omega, and we was there to support your boy Clip. You feel me? Uh -oh. right. So you got you got New Jersey Twerk and Lou? Lou Jerus, I got that. All right. Um, we going to move on to the next two verse two. Listen, man, listen. Steams and True, uh, Steams, yeah, Steams and True versus Chess and Zeus, man. Like, come on now. And y'all niggas, I hope y'all ain't expecting us to pick a winner and all this shit. Hey, nigga, we don't know. We don't know what to pick. I don't know what to pick. What the fuck? What do you pick with this right here? Like, what do you pick? Who do you pick? Like, what do you pick? Like, what do you go with? You get literally everything with this battle. It covers all, it covers everything. So, like, <laughs> yo, I can't, I can't lose. I'm a, I'm a winner. But if I had to keep it a buck, I'm gonna go with Cake Life, Steams and True. I'm gonna go with Cake Life, Steams and True. I don't know, I'll be man. With you. I'm gonna go with know. the bars over the pain. Shit. I'm gonna go with the bars Nigga, over the pain. That's me. Combined but pain, like the combined pain of like what Chess be talking about and Zeus at the same like Jesus I'm, Christ. This I'm Nigga I gonna cry. Really like gonna like Nigga's gonna shed tears. Make. Nigga's gonna shed tears. We're gonna have tissue and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like we we gonna be sweeping and shit. That's gonna be cool. And I'm a, you know what I'm saying that shit gonna give me goosebumps. But at the same time, yo, 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 Steams, man. Like I can't, I can't. You can't bet against Steams, yo. You can't. I can't. Can't. Steamo and True. <laughs> Oh, this is crazy, and bro. The thing about it too is that they can talk that. All right, it, I'm gonna keep it a buck. I'm gonna keep it a buck. I feel in this battle, Steams and True is lyrically better. It's gonna be lyrically better than Chess and Zeus. Mind you, they can also talk that pain shit in addition to how Chess and Zeus. See, Chess and Zeus knows how to deliver it better. But Steams and True can talk that pain shit too. 
Bro, I'm not gonna lie. This shit is like an even team to me. I feel like, I feel like both sides have a both sides. The partner picks up where the other lacks at. You feel me? Like it's. I don't know, man. This shit is perfect on paper. It's a perfect match. I honestly this though, is what I call a perfect a perfect matchup, son. Like it is. It's gonna be tough. It's perfect. Like I don't. That's, that's t- I'm, I can't pick. You said you said you got Steams and True. I got Steams and True edging it. You know what I'm saying? It's not gonna be clear because it's too damn. I don't know clear. I don't know about clear. Harris say you got Steams and True clear. I don't have them. I don't have it clear. You know what I'm saying? I don't have it clear. I got Steams and True winning, but it's gonna be a tough battle. Only only thing that'll mess this battle up is if Chess choke. I'm sorry. I gotta be the one to say it. If Chess yeah. choke, it ruins the battle, man. It's going to ruin it. I swear to fucking God if he chokes. Yo, As a fan of that... Chess, it is very cringeworthy that all of his material averages a choke in the battle. It's so cringeworthy. Like, do you know how tough it is to watch a battle and then, like, it comes up to the part where you know a nigga about the choke and you've just seen it so many times that you just say... I'm just gonna skip this part. Like I'm just gonna skip this part and go to Big Facts, big facts. Yo, True's an idiot, son. He said pick a fucking side before I call Tay. <laughs> pick a fucking side. I was in a building for that too. This nigga here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I got steams and true. I don't know. I don't care. Sleeves, who you got, man? <laughs> Ignis section. Sorry, man. Fuck that. I'm going to have to say I'm I'm going with Chess and Zeus. Fuck that, yo. All right, all right. I'm going uh, with Chess and Zeus, son. Like, fire. If, yo, if he don't choke and he, this shit clean, boy, this shit going to be crazy, son. Mm-hmm. This is about to be one of those crazy ones. I ain't, and this is three rounds? Is this three? Yo, Troll, is this three rounds? That's what I need to know. If it's three rounds, this is this is the one. Yeah, you want to get your popcorn. Everything rolled up because it's gonna be crazy. But um, why they find why they why they figure that out? The main the, event. The main event. Brooklyn Carter. One round, son. What? Oh my god! All right, so we know this is about to be clean. There's no way they. Now we know we about to get left with a debatable. Fuck out of here, y'all. Yup, it's gonna be. It's gonna be. A <laughs> yeah, I think this is, that's what I told niggas, yo. Steam nah, the truth. Nah, one makes sense. So y'all, facts, true, y'all, brother, son. One round, facts. Yeah. Facts. All right. Main event. I think it's the only battle left. Mm-hmm. Ish Mula versus Brooklyn Carter. I got Ish clear. I'm not gonna lie, I got Ish too. And Ish, Ish really, really wants this battle. Like when he really wants something, my nigga, it's really ugly. Like the nigga already be wilding without that. Like he wants this battle, and they've been talking crazy <laughs> up until. You know what I'm saying? The promotion for this shit with them two has been kind of ill. Them niggas been wilding on each other. It's one round. It's one round, son. I got Ish. I ain't gonna hold you. I got Ish. I got Ish, too. I got Ish. I got Ish, son. Carter got a bug out, Trevor. He got, like, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm, I'm gonna keep it all the way honest. Keep it a buck. I fuck with Carter, but here's my thing. When I see you at your best, I I I, I expect you to rap at, or after in that quality. You know what I'm saying? Like on that level. Like the last time I seen like a a, a, a remotely fired Carter was against Ty. You feel me? And before that was against Money. You feel me? So it's like. I didn't like that. I didn't like that. Uh, 
that gritty battle. Yeah. You know, I, yeah, I, I, I didn't like that battle. I'll be honest with oh, you. I didn't. Uh, to be honest, I didn't rewatch that battle. See, like, you see, like, facts, Ike squad, war report, shit. Um. Oh yeah, stacks. Yeah, I had you winning. I had you winning. I hope I hope Carter I hope Carter show I up. I think Tanium with the edge, but I think y'all gonna have a debatable battle. Yeah. But with Ish and Carter, I think Car I think um, I like Carter what I like Carter because his energy. When he starts cooking, that's the best Carter. Cause that's when he he starts to heat up and the momentum he gets that momentum, that steam. And that's him at his best. Mm -hmm. But in a sense, it's kind of do the same thing too. You feel yeah. me? When he gets that, that momentum and he starts hitting you with them, them nasty punches, like, come on. Like he has to this day probably the best themes flip ever. Son. I, I'm sorry. Just Ish is just different right now. So I don't see Carter winning this. I'm sorry. Tava, you saying that's most people not nah, in a in a we go hard setting is a little bit different. I'll be honest with you. I'll be honest with you, cause these guys Tava know how to absorb that crowd shit. and turn. Yeah, <laughs> these guys know how to absorb that absorb that crowd and turn that into something special. Like you could say that not everybody that is in we go hard can do that, bro. That's punches. Not everybody could do what Carter does or what um Steams does or what Ish does. You feel me? Like, it'd be a different type of energy, bro. It'll be a different type of energy. <laughs> uh, can we go hard like that neither? So you don't understand, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Never been in a long time, my guy. Yo, you know when you could just hear niggas say the shit they write? Like, you could hear the niggas saying the shit. I hear the niggas saying that, son. I hear Tyler saying that. You feel me? Yo, yo, we gonna do day two car real quick too, yo. We gonna run through day two real quick. All right, go ahead. Yo, oh, I see y'all. You know, Cali, Cali up in here on this joint. Oh, you know what I'm saying? I'm saying y'all see Bimo got the Cali squad out here. You know what I mean? Shout out to the, to the start five. Um, we gonna start with the first battle is uh, Miss Lisa versus Coffee. Coffee Honestly, <laughs> Coffee clear, y'all. Coffee clear. I'll be honest with you. Like, Miss Lisa, I, right, but, like, like, I don't, like, honestly, like, I, she be, she's okay. She's okay. Like, she's okay. I don't, I don't see her. And I got Coffee winning, but I don't, I don't know what is going to be the outcome, like, how crazy it's going to get. So, I, I got her winning, though. I got Coffee yeah. winning. I think yeah, um, yeah. Next one is a uh, paper versus swag Tanner, son. Ooh, I like this battle. Me it's too, a me definite too, me style too. clash for sure too. Um, Coliseum shit, my nigga Swag gonna win. Um, I think Swag gonna win clear. To be honest, I think Paper gonna be fire though, as usual. Paper a nigga that be fire, but he he be losing. Like you know what I'm saying? Like he one of those fire niggas that lose still. Like he gonna score thirty points, but his you know what I'm saying? He gonna lose still at that. You know what I'm, like, you know what I mean? Like he gonna score them points, but he's gonna lose. I don't feel I'm like gonna talk about that B Dub. Um, I think he nice. Paper? I like Paper. Swag, swag right now. Nah, paper. Swag is on. Swag is on the tear. I got swag. I got swag edging it. It's gonna be a fight though. I, got I like swag the battle a lot though. I like the matchup a lot. Like, no, I think I think swag gonna win, but I think paper gonna be fired too. So yeah, it's gonna be a fight. I'm not gonna say like got that swag clear. It's gonna be debatable. If it's one round, it's gonna be fire. If it's three rounds. It's gonna be tough for paper. Paper. Last time I seen uh, versus drift. 
I just think it was his third round that was his best round. Everything else was okay. Like, but it was drift. Round with the wild, he was cooking. He was cooking drip. The first two was okay. He, he's he's it was all right. He was beating drift because drift was. I think he was like stumbling and shit like that. But like, it's true. Right, Tan is gonna be different. If a different, he gonna he gonna bring a fight. He's bringing a fight. He's not. He's not playing. That's all I'm and gonna say. We go and he. This is we go hard debut. Yep. <laughs> I think I think paper gonna be dope. I I never really see paper not be. You know what I'm saying? Good. He's he's always on some shit. You know what I'm saying? But oh, swag shit. is just different, my nigga. Like, period. He's fire. Exactly, he's bro. different. Hold on, hold on, oh, tell her, tell her, tell her. Hold on, hold on, don't say that because who said you wasn't there at the last no. PGs? You wasn't there at the last PGs? Yeah, I did say that. Said I did say that. Rio, I, I, oh, I, I, Rio, I didn't say, I didn't say, I didn't say Prophet Rio. Prophet Briz, that shit was absurd when I watched that. I was like, what the fuck round did you? I still need to know what round did you give him with that? I watched at, that shit like. What round could you have possibly given profit? In the building, it was in the building. It was my nigga. He had a story talking about <laughs> being at war, having an AK, getting in a fucking gunship, shooting the gun, and turning the corner, and then seeing Lo, uh, and seeing Young Grizz. It made no sense. What's I don't know how he ended up seeing Grizz. He was at war at one point in the guard. In the gunship, he said it. I'm in the I'm in the fucking ATV with the gun shits or some shit. Pop locking when he did the shit. You know what I mean? And then he said Grizz was around the corner somehow. This little nigga around the corner. Whatever. I, I didn't understand what he was talking about. That nigga need yeah. to stop that. He need to stop, son. He need to get straight into some bars. And he did versus Mad Face. Like, and Mad he Face did, he did in the second and third, but he still need to do more. He need to add more. He still was trying to get Tupac-ish. <laughs> nigga don't need that to battle rap, son. Kill this nigga. Kill this nigga, son. You feel me? Like, it was just irrelevant shit he was saying. Yeah, let's get back on track. Yeah, Terra be on that bullshit. Tell the shout to my brother Terra, big bro. All right, man. <laughs> um, Slide Tanner versus up. Paper. What was the next one? Oh, yeah. I had swag, and you said you had you you said swag. Debatable, right? Oh, you had yeah. swag. All right. Yes, yeah, swag. Uh, next one is P Easy versus the Spot. Cali Cali shit, my nigga Spot. I got Spot. I got Spot edging it. You know, I, I, shout out to P Easy, man. Shout out to P Easy. But unless, first of all, let me say this: the Spot. Just came off of uh, he kind he he fucked up at the Kali. You know what I'm saying? He fucked up. You know he, he took a he, his PG and his uh battle at the Kali was close together, so his prep time was thrown off. Right. He had time to prep for P Easy. He is going to give P Easy a show. Pause. Like, it's gonna be a fight. I got that shit getting crazy, but I, I do got to say I got my boy Spot 2-1. Um, I think P. Easy, if P. E. You know what it is? Sometimes P. Easy to me could be a little bit inconsistent. Like, he's not as good as certain battles. You know what I'm saying? Like, or he'll have certain good moments, and then it'll run out, and then he'll, you know what I'm saying, too many dry spots. So I'm hoping with the prep time he has as well that he matches up well with the you know for three rounds with enough material to you know what I'm saying I don't I I, I think PZ style is different but sometimes it could be a little bit you know slow and lackluster and I don't I don't really like it too much when he is yeah. in that phase I don't like when he gets like that and he's not saying nothing to me you know what I mean but I think he's gonna punch more because he knows spot. You know what I'm saying? He knows he's heard. He knows the spot is a puncher, and he knows he's going to have a lot of that. So I think, Pete, we're going to get a real Pete, good Pete easy. But 
I got the spot with an edge to <clears throat> two on two on edge. Yeah. Terror, they both terror, they got they both got something to prove in that in that regard, you know, because first of all, the last time the spot was over here, he did okay, but let's be honest, like he it just he pretty much just got his foot in on the East Coast, did his thing on the West Coast, and he didn't get that call to come back on the East Coast and he got a bone to pick, pause, you know what I'm saying? Like Terror, he don't wanna... cut your shit, man. Cut your shit, Terror. <laughs> He's gonna wanna prove a point. And this is gonna be a I think it's gonna be a fight. I think this might be the best battle of the night, honestly. This might be the really night. Fucking crazy thing. Yeah. It could be. It's definitely up there. Next up. What we got? Uh, tape deck versus kid death. Yo. Yo, I ain't I'm not excited for this. I'll be honest with you. I'll be honest, I'm not excited. I think Tate Deck going wild the fuck out, though, son. We ain't see Tate Deck and we go hard in a minute. And the last time I uh, seen him, he, I think it was really fire. Nah, I last had, time, it was that, um, it was one of those, it was one of those events. I forgot what it was. It was, uh, was it the We At War or some shit we battled? Like, it was a battle that nobody cared about. Yo, like, this man, Tara, you starting your bullshit, man. Get the hell out of here. How you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm not excited for that battle. I'll be honest with you. Take Deck is, he's dope, but he's boring. And then you have Kid Death. He, he has, like, a lot of aggression performance, but his bars be... Wow, well, at this, like, he, he's, it, it's Kid shaky. Death shaky. great performance was at the Coliseum, man. <laughs> Back, it's Austin Ave. That was his best performance still to date. I don't care what anybody say. I agree. Kid, but I ain't gonna, I, I got, I, if it's three rounds, I gotta take that to one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with Kid Death. I'm gonna go with Kid Death. All right. Um, next up, I like this battle. Sko versus Scotty, yo. Scotty good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Yo, this is gonna be entertaining. Yo, I'll be honest. This is super entertaining, son. This nigga Sko is so fucking funny, my nigga. Like, and Scotty, but I'm gonna tell you this. I think Scotty not gonna play. He not gonna play with this, this, this battle. Like, he's gonna really, like, try to violate. He's gonna go in. If he's smart, he will. If he brings that energy off of the battle with Ish, he needs that and co to continue that. You feel me? If he continues that. Yo, I'll be honest with you. Mm -hmm. I could just see him. Hold up. Oh! <laughs> Did he hit the buzzer beater just now? He hit it! Pause! He made the shit. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> That nigga don't want to go to four. <laughs> he don't want to go seven games, boy. He don't. Wow. My fault. My ignorant section. The buzzer beater in Cleveland, too. That's a haymaker. Clutch. His wife better have an extra bitch in the crib tonight. <laughs> Yo. That nigga is hype, boy. Hold on, let's let's be clear though. You can't be this hype in the first round, son. <laughs> Boy, that nigga struggling. This shows the stress right now. This this gonna be the playoffs, LeBron. He gonna, he gonna cut the ball. He gonna cut it. Cut the ball, D. He gonna do it. He got to, he son. Going. He got wow. to. Dude. He yeah, changed the shit out that nigga. But um, yeah, I got Scotty beating Sco. But in a I very entertaining battle. You know what? I got Skull being Scotty. Like, can't pick Skull. You know why? I like Skull, but he don't be having no bars. And he be rapping like he is 2005, son. I'm not going to hold you. He be rapping like it's 2005 still. All of his bars. He doesn't really have haymakers like that. It's all funny shit. And they be funny, but it, how much funny is it going to be? You know what I'm saying? How funny. If it's one round, though. If it's one round, I'm going with Skull. If it's three rounds, I'm going with Scotty. 
I think it's one round. I'm going with I'm going with Scotty. I'm gonna go with Scotty. Yo, I think son, it's gonna be entertaining. Of course, yo, his hairline, yo, son. <laughs> It looks like somebody it's pulled up a one. faucet. That shit is padded on. You patched that on, nigga. You just... Yo, it looked like somebody pulled up a carpet. You see that, that shit? shit? Whoa, whoa, don't wipe too much, big fella. <laughs> Yo. Wipe it off. Son. This shit outrageous, son. He got he to gotta get the ball, you son. Come home, LeBron. Come home, bro. It looked like somebody taking up weeds in the garden, kid. Yo, next oh. battle though. This one is this one is really fire. Co main event. Yeah. Bangs versus Young Grizz, man. Oh I forgot about this. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> All right, so the spot in P Easy is my dark horse battle of the night. This was oh, I don't dark... know why. I didn't like that. I don't like that line. Don't use that. All right, my fault. Pause. All right, pause. pause. <laughs> don't, don't you... Sleeper. Just... That's my sleeper. That's my sleeper. All right, there you go. Perfect. <laughs> All right. All right, bet. All right, so uh, this is going to be the battle of the night. Young Grizz versus Bangs. I don't know. I, I don't know who to pick, my nigga. This shit's going to be net. It's going to be ridiculous, yo. I don't even know, son. This shit's going to be crazy. I ain't gonna front. I think Bangs could win, man. I think I think Bangs could win, but only if he goes second. If he gets to go rebuttal every round, that's I I feel like that's when Bangs be at his best when he gets to go second, because he gets the rebuttal for. All three rounds. I don't know how serious he taking this battle though. He don't be writing a lot, like. You know oh, uh, he has to. I think he has to because if he doesn't, Grizz is going to smoke Bangs. Yeah, because Bang. I think Grizz gonna be dope regardless, but it it depends on what Bangs do about the win or loss though. Because if Bangs, if Bangs come there at a hundred, I think he gonna win. If he's there at a hundred and he really took this serious, he wrote his rounds for real, and he ain't on some. The nigga battles every week. He got another battle or some shit. Like he got battles. He had bat like two battles or some shit before this. I don't know if he did it. He don't. He hasn't been slacking that we go hard as of, as of late. Like the last time I remember Bangs battling was what Flip at we go hard. Um, yeah, Uncle yeah. Flip. Was it? Hell no. He had way more battles after that. We just now I'm talking about that. We go hard. We go hard. Oh, at we go hard. Yeah, I think so. Was it flip? I think so. I think so. I'm somebody. Correct me if I'm wrong. But in that battle, Bangs was disgusting. His rebuttal game and in like in round freestyling. Oh, you know why? Because him and Teddy battle. That's why I keep thinking like I'm thinking like it's a We Go Hard battle. It was on. It was a PG. It was the right. one off. Facts. My bad. Nah. Not PG. My fault. Not PG, y'all. Don't. Th not PG. One off. Don't. Don't crucify me and shit. Sarah, how does, how does that you. not matter? You understand? We're talking about We Go Hard. It's one thing if you're talking about other leagues and stuff like that, but if I'm talking about the last time he performed on We Go Hard, he was actually good. That actually counts. I just say if Bang show up on 100, though, like, then I got him winning. But if if it's a random Bangs, I think Grizz going to end up with the win. So, fire battle, though. Definitely think it's going to be a possible battle of the night, if not the spot in uh, P.E.Z. I got Grizz taking that battle. Okay. I got Grizz well, taking that battle. Main event, Badafi versus Franchise. Ooh. Yo, I like this battle, but I think Badafi going wild out on this nigga. Yeah, I got Badafi winning too. Franchise is one of them niggas. The random 100,000 bars. I think he dope, but he just I have three for three rounds of a hundred, like a hundred random ass bars. That's for anyone. But Daffy is gonna focus like he's a direct haymaker type battler. Like he makes haymakers with direct 
You know what I'm saying? With direction. Like, he's going to directly punch this nigga and make mad punches off of it. Like, he's about to violate the whole franchise. I know it's going to be mad franchise flips. He is. He is. He is. It's going to be he's gonna ugly. violate that. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know. if Franchise going to, you know, I think he's going to cook. But I, I got Badafi clearly taking that battle, to be honest. Same here. I got, Same here. I got him clearly winning that. And he been on the tear. Like, he ain't been slacking at all. No slacking, yeah. right, franchise? Well, you about to get a nigga that ain't slacking at all. Like, he ain't slacking, bro. <laughs> this is fed. And you know what? Green hasn't, he hasn't, he don't take battles like that. You feel me? So, he's sitting on some shit. And he's about to, yo, I'm not going to lie to you. It's going to be ugly for franchise, yo. I think like he's about said. to wild out. I ain't going to hold you. And this is a big battle for him. You know what I'm saying? So it's definitely yeah. one of the biggest battles that have been on his plate so far. So I've known yeah. he's about to wild out. So, you know, yeah, I got, I got Badafi clearly winning that. He's going to talk to franchise. And then, like you said, that and plus I that know him like the franchise did the last time he was over there and we go hard. You know what I'm saying? He got all crazy with one, you know what I'm saying, with Carter. <laughs> right. And this is interesting because ain't both of them um, FTW? So this is an interesting yeah, match. So. Yeah. This is very interesting, yeah. yo. This is definitely an FCW fight. Yeah. But yeah, I got Badafi on that, man. I got Badafi too. And that's it. Yes, sir. That's it. That's a wrap. That's that's all the battles. That's Love Day Three for Shizo. Love Day Three continues, and then um, that's on Sunday, and then Word. Saturday is gonna be Love Day Four. If you can't make it, hit up City for the for the um for the private pay per view line type thing. You feel me? He'll let you know how to how to purchase it, and that way you could you know. Watch the battles live. Yes, but this sir. is something you want to. You def, this is something you definitely want to pull up to if you're in a New York City area. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can make it pull up because this shit's gonna be crazy. This shit's gonna be crazy. Like I never, I didn't, I never seen a car like this in a while. Got Cali, Cali pulling up on day two. It's gonna be lit. Me in the building. I'm in the building for sure. Yeah, I gotta talk in these live. Tyro, you be wanting blood, son. You be wanting us to come on. Like, listen, nigga, this nigga's <laughs> trash. If he don't do this shit, he gonna die. It's over. Tyro want blood. This nigga. <laughs> you gotta talk greasy. I don't like that, Tyro. Change that. I don't it's like that. Good, man. It's the playoffs is on, Tyro. Niggas ain't watching this shit. They watching the game. Y'all can't be. Y'all can't be saying greet yo, Paul, son. I need this. <laughs> oh yeah, that's 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 a little crazy. <laughs> y'all can't be y'all can't be saying whoa that. why did you put it in caps <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ yo we out I'm off yeah. this that was crazy that was crazy that was wild later <laughs>